I'm gonna show you one of my favorite fall side dishes. This is great for a holiday meal, really anytime. I love just fall weather, but I also love what comes along with it. So if you don't like Brussels sprouts, I'm gonna make you a fan tonight. This is one pound of Brussels sprouts that I've already washed and trimmed. I cut them in half just so they're small enough. I like to get them nice and brown and caramelized. And then I'm just gonna cut up. I've got four carrots, kind of small ones, and then I've got three parsnips. I love these. I don't know if you've ever had them before. They're delicious. Don't pass them by in the grocery store. Usually see them, sometimes they sell them singly, but usually they come in a bag kind of like carrots do. And I don't even know how to describe it, but they're a little bit more potato-like than a carrot, right, texture. But I guess kind of like have a slight anise flavor. They're just so good. When you roast them, they just get sweet. So I like my vegetables kind of cooked through. So I'm gonna cut them relatively small in size, not in big chunks, just so I, um, I wanna get them, I like them soft. I don't want them like, you know, crunchy, like I'm having them in the salad, right? Okay, all gonna go on. And honestly, the easiest thing with this is um, I have the oven set to 400 degrees. I'm gonna toss these in just a little bit of olive oil, salt and pepper. We're gonna roast them about 35 minutes so they're nice and brown. And then I'm gonna make a little sauce stick on the top. Fabulous. So I probably just wanna to try to get them as even in size as I can, just so they all cook about the same time. Okay, so I get them all chopped up. I love using this parchment paper on the bottom of a, of a baking pan. It just makes it easy cleanup. You don't have to though. But I'm just gonna put a little bit of kosher salt, just kind of making sure I'm covering all the veggies. And then some ground black pepper. I love this little gadget. Okay, looks so good. And what's great about this, this recipe too is that it's fairly healthy, right? A lot of times at the holidays, We've got a lot of rich foods, and so sometimes it's nice to have just something a little bit lighter on the side. We've got all those gravies and the stuffings, but I just think it's a little bit cleaner. So just about three tablespoons of the oil, and now I'm just gonna give this all a mix. You could do this in a bowl, but you know what? It just saves me one more thing to clean up. But you do wanna make sure that you get everything nicely coated. And then I'm gonna get this in the oven and I'll show you how to finish it off when it's done. Okay, these veggies smell amazing. They're nice and caramelized, just the way I like them. Okay, I'm just gonna put these in this bowl. Oh, it smells so good already. We're not even done yet. Without making too much of a mess. So we just got some carrots, some parsnips, some Brussels sprouts, and all we do is have a little bit of olive oil, a little bit of salt and pepper. That's it so far. So so easy, right? So I like these kind of side dishes too because when you've got so much else going on at the holidays, it's nice to have a super simple one that you can do like right before the movie gets there. Okay, so all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add just a little bit of orange zest, about a half the orange. Okay, going in, gives us a nice, vibrant, I love citrus. Oh, it even smells so good, hitting the warm veggies. Okay, that's good, and then I'm gonna slice, and I'm just gonna juice just about half of the orange. Okay, half of the orange going in. Mmm, smells so good, healthy. Pack with flavor. Okay, to finish this off, this is a balsamic glaze. Okay, so I always have this on hand. If you don't, you could also just reduce a regular balsamic down. You just have to cook it down until it gets like syrup. This just saves me one step. Okay, so I'm gonna put, I'm just gonna eyeball it, but about three tablespoons. And that's about one. That's about two. And that's about three. And you can go back and you can, you know, taste it and you know, to, to your liking. And got some good Texas local honey going in. And about two tablespoons of that. It's funny, Texan with the Boston accent, right? Okay, just gonna give this all a stir. Oh my gosh. 
Who would want to eat their veggies if they look like this coming out of the table? All right. Now I'm just gonna put it, it's got this cool little serving dish. I don't know if you all like to thrift, but Eric and I do. And we found this like lovely little bowl. I mean, I don't know, four or five dollars. You can get some great deals. Okay. Oh my gosh, that looks so good. I'm gonna give it a taste for you, hang on. I'm going in for a pasta, because those are probably my favorite. Oh my God. Mm -hmm. You will definitely love eating your veggies with these. Balsamic, the citrus coming through, a little bit of that honey, fabulous. Enjoy.